Hello everybody, Burnt Out Guy here, and welcome back to Cosmeteer. Alright, so, uh, I think the first thing we're gonna do is upgrade our little ship here today, and, uh, make it a little bit better. Um, I think we have good forward action here going on with our lasers and stuff, but there's just not enough penetration. <laughs> And uh, we need to uh, get farther in there. So one of the things I do want to fix right off the bat is the fact that um, there's no door here. And yeah, now we're going to have a forward laser and that's going to help uh, a little bit better. Quite a bit better. So now this is my plan. This is kind of my plan. Um, I'm thinking about adding... Uh, wings to this thing, right? And this is kind of what I have going on. I just need to fix it up a little bit so that way we... Uh, yeah. That way we uh, we can build this thing. So. I wanted to bring that down. Alright, so that's pretty good. They got a way in, they got there. I want, this is ammo storage. And that way they have access to ammo. So ammo is going to get stored here and here. So this is like a backup for this one. Uh, this is going to be the feeders. These are going to be the gunner barracks. And these are going to be the feeder barracks. Hopefully there should be enough. Um, that makes four guys on each side feeding guns, right? Feeding bullets, so that should be more than enough. And then I think that was about it, really. And then I think now we can, like, kind of do something like this. Uh, I do want that going to the end. I want to protect that ammo as much as I can. And then we'll just do a double line like that. Make sure we're getting well protected. Uh, back here is fine. Just do a little something like that or design. Um, that's pretty good. Um, almost kind of wondering if I should do that. There we go. Got ourselves a, a Klingon bird of prey going on here. This is dope. That looks sick. All right. Um, I'm just worried about thrust, though. Like, uh, if we're not going to have enough power to push this puppy. Like, thrust-wise. So I'm thinking about doubling up on these instead. Instead of having storages here, right? And then maybe I can configure this a little bit better so I can have, like, all four of them touching. Let's try that. Let's try something like that. And then go to here. The huge ones. Uh... See, I would have to kind of, like, put two engine rooms, right? Which probably would be okay. Oh, crap. I think that would be okay. So let's corridor that. And then... I got five extinguishers there. Oh, those are airlocks. Okay, so I don't really have... I just have the two fire extinguishers there. I should put some more of those out there. Um, flip them around. I just noticed that. Bam. Alright. Uh, I think that should be okay. I think that should be okay. Do I see any flaws? I don't know. Let me just have a little quick look. So we got fire extinguishers back here in case any fire. I really technically should do the same thing here. <coughs> I 
There, we'll put them there like that. I think that should be good. All right. I think that's fine. Let's uh, let's make it so. Uh, let's back up because that's going to be absolutely horrendous. I like the fact that you got no limit on your ship designs, right? Like everything is pretty, pretty good. Now it's going to place everything. But it's going to place things wrong. All right, so let's go to resource management. I want nothing but ammo here. And I want nothing but ammo here. Now, if we go to uh, this. Oh, I should have been done on both sides, actually. Oh, it was. Okay, that's good. So, resource. Chain supply. So I want this one to supply that, this to supply that, and that. You supply that. There we go. <laughs> so that should be like that on both sides. That's good. All right, so all ammo should go here. And if there's room here, it'll get transferred there and so forth into the guns all right let's let that happen make sure that uh, everything happens here so it looks like we're short on power at the moment because everybody's kind of busy doing their thing but that's fine we're just sitting there around the space station organizing so as soon as it's done i'll come back all right so it seems like they're finally done placing stuff around which is good um so now let's go and kind of like test this guy out a little bit i don't know how well the guns are going to get fed because we're kind of like lacking people so this might be a little lackluster at first until we build up a little bit more fame but we have a bunch of area to explore here so um actually this is not even the right area um, I want to go here. So before I do that, actually, I want to save the game. There you go. That way, if anything happens, I can, uh, we can go there. Then we'll go here. And then we should be okay to go there. Avoid that sun, man. Avoid that sun. That's like, uh... A death to your ship right there, boy. Let me tell you. Worst thing you could do is fly through here. I did it once. Lost my entire ship. It's crazy. But it happens. It happens to the best of us. A few choice words were spoken that day. <laughs> Let me just tell you. Uh, Alright, so we should have enough fuel to get back home. We're back to the first area anyways. <clears throat> and then we should be able to fly around and... Uh... Oh, yeah. I'll just have to collect some if we ever want to go back. All right. So I'm going to start flying around. And as soon as I find something, I will come back. And I won't let you all suffer. Oh, well, look at this. Right away. Let's find out how she's going to do. Guyly kind of looks like a reverse of what I am. <laughs> Alright. So we see you now. You're a defense tower. Alright. It's a lonely little defense tower doing out here all by its lonesome. Well, that was, uh, that was very well done. I like it. That was just a defense tower, though, but still, that wasn't too bad. All right, I'll continue on, and like I said, if I find something half-decent, I'll, uh, 
I'll come back. All right, so we got contact. Come here, buddy. I gotta test my metal. Where'd you go? Where? All right. Looks like I've taken out already a little bit of it. This is why I wanted to get guns on the side. So that way we still do damage to them. I messed them up. <laughs> the only problem is that their stuff scatters a little bit more, but that's fine. Thank you for your patronage. Alright, off we go. Oh, we got a signal out here. We'll go check that out right quick. What is it? Uh, small storage pod. Well, thanks. <laughs> Alright, well, I'll come back when I find something new. Oh, I love this. They're full of pirates out here. This is great. Come here, buddy. It's like a pretty forward uh, facing gun here. Oh, come on, bud. Don't leave me hanging. I could stop using the mining lasers. Like, I could, um, I think you can group stuff. And put them all, uh, and turn them on and off. That might be something that I could check into and, uh, and learn how to do. Because that could uh, actually free up some crew when I'm not really using the mining lasers, maybe. That wouldn't probably be a bad idea. But, uh, yeah, I'll check into that eventually. <laughs> oh, what do we got here? We have a ship that we can scavenge. We can either take it over or scavenge it, but uh, I prefer scavenging. And uh, we'll repair at the same time. All right, good stuff. So let's just go over here. And I'll continue around. When I find more stuff, we'll come back. Like always. Every time I say that, like, uh, something happens. See? See? See, we got a whole whack of guys out here. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna save the game because if anything happens, at least uh, I'm not losing all that progress. All right, so let's slowly make our way in here. See if we can draw these guys out. I think it would be the smartest thing to do instead of try to engage them all at once. <clears throat> Seems to be in a hell of an asteroid field. Maybe we can entice this guy to come over. Alright, I got another target in here now. He's got a lot of guns and some disruptors, so we might want to try to take them out. Um... I think I'm toast. Yeah, I am toast. Not much left of my ship, boy. Alright, so, looks like we're doing a, a load. That, uh, that is insane, ladies and gentlemen. That's a lot of firepower that's over there. I guess I got in too close, maybe. Man, is that a lot of guys? I, that is a lot of guys. You have to try to find a way to fly in and... And not, uh... 
not attract every single one of them. It's so like all like a swarm. Now uh, there's probably gun turrets around there too as well. <clears throat> like I said, let's see if we can get uh, one to come out this way. Don't want to really entice too far. that can in there too, right? Just trying to be cautious. Come on, buddy. Follow me out here. Alright. We should be good to attack them now. See if we can get rid of uh, these disruptors right here. was pretty good. Keep her finger on this, that way gotta call people back if we can. That's not bad, one guy at a time, that's how we do it. Alright, let's fix our ship. So we can stay on the top of our game. Alright, we'll save it. Alright, let's see if we can get a another one to follow us out here. A little bit at a time, man. A little bit at a time. We'll get these guys. It's like pecking them off from me. Good strategy, though. Hey, man. Okay, so you got disruptors here. Okay, I, I knew there was another guy around. This way. Do a quick repair. Of whatever I can, anyways. Oh, you're gutsy. Okay, I'm doing a times eight thing here, and I shouldn't be. Okay, so you seem to be dancing around that. Are you like their, their last call of hope? Looks like it. I mean, you look like a rocket launcher guy, so you'd be okay. You keep launching your missiles into the uh, into the asteroid, but we'll be good. All right. You guys seem to be out of reach, so we'll just harvest this right here. down here. I think there was more stuff to harvest here too. Oh yeah. Uh, all the way down there. I think those are 
Uh, ordnance. Probably uh, parts of the ship, I guess. There we go. Give me all that stuff, people. Good shit. Alright. Let's fix. What's left of this? That's uh, all sulfur out there. Yeah, I'm not gonna really worry about that. Um. Okay, I almost got this base destroyed, so. I'll just have to come back and. Oh, shit. <clears throat> Alright. So. Let's get rid of the side guns that are facing me. seem to be doing some damage. We need to get the hell away from you. <clears throat> okay, my ship's in pretty bad shape. I'm gonna go back to base. Uh, here. And we're gonna heal up. I think that would be the best thing to do. We can sell some stuff too. We'll come back. Yeah, sometimes it's uh, best to fight another day. Is that what they say? I think that would be a good idea. Then that way we don't uh, have to save scum. But, uh, yeah. Doing pretty good, though. We're doing pretty good. I think uh, once we get these guys done, we should be... Uh, we should be balling. Hopefully we'll get some more, uh, more crew. That would be nice. All right, so first things first, let's fix that. Then we'll hail you. Let's get rid of some stuff here. Uh, I don't want to keep. Well, I guess we uh, ain't trading much, but that's fine. Seem to have uh, quite a bit of stuff left on me, but that's okay. Are we fully repaired? No. There we go. Beautiful. All right, round two, bastards. I'm gonna come up this way. I'm gonna try to take out the the stuff that's around it, and then uh, we'll go from there. I think that's a good plan of action. I didn't check to see if I uh, I lost people or anything like that though, but that's fine. Alright, so we know. Are you a good guy or a bad guy? You look like a good guy because it didn't attack. It's green, though. Uh -huh. I think this side would be better. Ah, the hell. Just I was gonna go and aim on it to, to attack it. All right, let's concentrate over here now. It's like kicking the shit out of our ship. to uh, get away here. <laughs> I 
I think it'd be best to go repair our ship again. And then come back and do it again. Or as long as we weaken them and we're not like killing ourselves. Because we are uh, losing some good infrastructure here. So I don't want to don't want to have ourselves blown up because they find a weak spot. Uh, let's do this. Let's hail them for crew. Okay, I'm bad. I only lost two crew, so that's pretty good. All right, let's get back out there and try it again. You know, they don't heal, so it's okay to uh, uh, Star Trek Enterprise, kind of. All right. Uh, I started taking them out from the bottom last time, like uh, the time before, and I weakened them quite a bit from down there. Let's try that again. I think that would be the better thing to do. But then he, oh, looks like your guns did come back. So you do heal yourself. did take a hell of a beating though. We don't have much of a ship left. That's fine. We keep hammering away like this, we'll we'll win. As long as he doesn't get a, the opportunity to turn. Alright. Try to dig our way through this ship. That's awesome, people. We got pretty screwed up in the process too, but I think uh, <laughs> I think she was worth it. All right, let's just uh, click the stuff nearby, and then see if we can repair our own ship at the same time. And then I'll put down a beacon here. Um, wreck and then I can keep coming back here and uh, getting all the stuff and making a fortune off of it that's good that's really good <laughs> I'm so happy all right guys doing a good job out there the well, cargo hold is looking pretty full it's getting there so I'll have to probably do a couple of trips back and forth here to get all the stuff and probably a few trips around the system to sell all of this stuff, because uh, that's a lot of crap to sell. And I'm okay with all the ammo we have. I'll just sell extra. And we'll go from there. But yeah, man, these guys are doing... They're hauling ass. I like all the storage space I got. It's great. A lot of it's ammo, though, but... One more. Perfect. Let's go back and sell all that stuff. See if there was a mission for uh, defeating that station. Because I was pretty close to this one. So I figured there might be something for that. Which would be good. So let's hail them. Uh, eliminated. Except we did it, Peps. Damn straight. Woohoo! <laughs> now we just got these faction ones, but I'm not too interested in the whole faction thing, really, to be honest with you. Nice! 14 more crew! Yes! That was exactly what we needed, man. That's exactly what we needed. 
Um, let's sell those, some of those. As much as this as we can, I guess. There we go. Lighten our load a little bit. Perfect. All right. So I guess that's where we're going to call it. We did a pretty damn good job today. I think these upgrades uh, helped out a lot. Um, as we continue to gain more fame, we'll be able to get more crew, which is probably the big key to this game, is getting the amount of crew for your infrastructure so you can like kind of expand like this. So what we'll do in the next episode is we'll continue unveiling everything that we have here, and then hopefully we can find more big pirate ships and stuff like that and uh, slowly work up on your building up our ship. I don't think it's a good idea to like venture into the other systems too fast because I think you're gonna have what we had last time where we're gonna run up against a guy and he's just gonna mop the floor with us, right? So I think this is probably the best option for us is to slowly take it easy and kind of go from there. Uh, let me just uh, repair that. That way it's done for this episode. Awesome. Perfect. So, I hope you enjoyed the video, everybody. Peace, take care, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.